Last four turns, everyone. Get ready. Uh, only one, two, five, ten. Back with. What I'm hoping is the finale of. Let's mess around on Mario Party Five. My one year anniversary special. Hoping, but. Still. Even though I'm hopeful that this will be, this will be the end of the game, uh, it's still Mario Party, so. You use all that money on yourself to move your capsule to someone else. Give it to me. What? What the? the hell is the point of that? You just wasted 15 coins, or however many it was, I think it was 15, just to do that. Is my head on straight? There's, there's something I'm not seeing here. I don't know what it is, though. Oh, I see what it is. I'm getting shitty rolls. How on earth am I supposed to win like this? This is my anniversary special. I'm supposed to be the big winner. Me well, well, Waluigi. Waluigi might go go the first here. He's really got nothing to lose here. The 50 coins? Oh, that was me. They're like 50 coins, pal. What's that? Um, pump and jump. Thank God, I'm not playing this game. It's impossible against the hard AI. It's another button masher. Just mash the A button for 10 seconds. See who can fly the highest. I were playing this right now, I would have lost. I believe Peach has won, so. That, that, that's obscene. Wow. I actually thought Peach would have won. But yeah, I probably would not have gotten that high. Maybe like 300 yards or so. That was close to 500. Because, because the AI is programmed to ma like mash their figurative A button at like inhuman speeds. So what am I supposed to do? Now everything's gone backwards. Flower shower. We have not played this one, and at the rate this is going, we're never going to play this one. I love how most of, if not all of the latter half of this game is just, just me getting up, like and remaking the disc read itself again. I don't know what I'm doing. To be fair, I know what I'm doing. I just don't know how to word anything, because we speak English food. Anyway. Flower shower. You run around and jump and catch flowers. Pink ones are worth one, gold's worth three. As it does. Oh, and being in the water slows you down. Don't be in the water. There you go. Dang it. Yeah, I won. Aw, oh, I thought I had 30. No, I caught the bouquet. Suck it, nerds! Ha <laughs> ha! Well, I definitely have the mini game star and the coin star if it counts. So I've got at least seven right now, technically. Uh, three 
supposed to go? It all comes down to what Koopa Kid rolls at this point. That's a chain chomp. Chain chomp capsule and eye without a bone. Hmm. Oh, the AI is programmed to go after who's in first. He has one too? I need at least a two-star gap between me and Cuba Kid by the time the game's over. Otherwise, there's no way I'm beating him. Uh, this way. Five. Ooh. Ooh. Gotta not mess this up. I, I, I obviously wanted to get duplicate, and Waluigi, Waluigi just screwed himself. Welcome to Bowser's spin stage. Good luck getting out. Four-player minigame. Frozen Frenzy, we've played this one before. I really want to play Fish Upon a Star. I know that will cause the game to, to stop being red. But I still want to at least play it, because it's fun. Okay, back to this. Back down here. You... Back here. Just kicking people really stuns them. So, ow. So I'm just going to stand up here. Oh, this isn't working. This plan did not work! Come get me! Yeah, that's right. You can't. I know it. Yeah, I have the best. My like my fridge is like right there, so it wouldn't be too much of a hassle. Now I need to hope if we get smart, he'll use that mushroom capsule and take the star. Luckily, the AI has done some interesting things before, so I'm not too concerned. Nine. <laughs> Twister right capsule. Okay. Well, that was convenient. Unfortunately, I know she's gonna steal it from Waluigi because he's in first, even though Koopa Kid's close to the star. She's taking it from Koopa Kid. Huh? Well, that was most interesting. I was pretty... S well, I guess Waluigi's stuck in the spin stage where he can't arm anyone. Uh. So now I'm not as worried as I was. Why do I want him to land on the space with the 
twister effect on it. Ooh, we landed on Bowser. Okay. This is the first time we've seen him all game! Thanks to Waluigi, we'll be seeing nothing but him every turn now. So what's this gonna be? This next event? The Bowser Bonus! You're in luck, that's the Bowser Bonus. I'll give you a star star since you're so lucky. This takes one star away from you. So Koopa Kid has gone from being a considerable threat to not a threat at all. I need to avoid the same fate. I think I landed on the space behind the star. Nope. One behind the space behind the star. I would have moved the star space. But I just lost 10 coins. Nope, he's just turning them red. My god, that would be so messed up if that would have happened, though. You can get a lot of battle games this way, though. Because, like I said, if four people land on red spaces, it's an instant battle game. If each goes far enough, she'll get hit one. Koopa Kid and I are pretty much forced to get one at this point. And Waluigi, unless he gets a happening space and gets out of the spin stage, will always, like, will always land on a red space. How much time do I have left? Five minutes. I don't think that'll be enough to finish it. Dang. Oh, we got out. Wow, that was lucky. You got lucky, but you'll be back. Man, he ever. Team Free versus Cuba Kid. Alright. Heat Stroke. One player tries to knock the Everfree off the blocks, while the Everfree must jump to avoid getting knocked off. Koopa Kid can hit A to swing the hammer, or B to do a fake swing. And we can move and jump, and ground pound by hitting A and then A again. The player with the hammer can try to fake out the Everfree by pressing B, and the free players must also watch out for falling Kota Boots. He also has a limited amount of tries as well, besides 30 seconds. Dang it. If you get faked out like that, you're done instantly. Okay. Um, if you get hit all of them, there's a sudden spot. And when we land on that, we're all safe. So the team of free wins by le by time running out, or if all of those platforms get knocked off. Unfortunately, me and Waluigi couldn't do much of anything because... Oh, this is the last turn? Oh! Screw you, Peach! All I wanted was another star. And you had to do that. You heartless charlatan. You heartless charlatan. Okay, I think that's the game then. <laughs> no one's gonna be able to get to that one. I think it's game. I win. Flawless victory. Um. Oh, that's, oh, that's ten coins. Whoops. This is. This is delaying the game. Foul call, delay of game. Just to do that! Thanks! I don't know who has the happening star. So I may want to take it from Luigi. But Peach screwed me over one time, so actually no, it wasn't her, it was Cooper Kid, but my 
but buy it. Um, and that is why you carry bone capsules on you, children. So rapid chain chomp attacks don't affect you. I love how I hit it with my nose, and that's how I collected it. I love how it took me this long to figure that out. Whatever. Oh no, I lost three coins, but I got a star. It was worth it. This is going to help you out so much. Hey, it's your color. Minute 52. So I think... I can get for this mini game. Clock stoppers, okay. I'm gonna try to win this time. Push down to the clock to match the clock in the middle. Okay, so this time I'm actually gonna. Oh yeah, I played this one before and I screwed Waluigi over. Okay, so this time I'm actually gonna be serious. What are you doing, man? You don't go fast by having two people do it. Okay, we were kind of closer to that one, so... Oh crap. What were we supposed to do there? Dang it. Stuck. Ah, oh, we were so close. Oh well. Ooh. So I will see you guys for well. Now nah, just kind of wait and then play some together. See, see you. Guys. All right. Now let's just see how nice we did! First, let's take a look at the star total. Star count looks like that. And now, how many coins we all managed to get? I got the most. Now for bonus stars! For each bonus you win, you get one star. First is minigames. Whoever got the most co coins in minigames goes to... It goes to Yoshi! Yay! Next is the coin star, the player who collects the most coins overall in the game. That winner is Yoshi! Yay! The last bonus goes to the happening star. This one goes to the player who had on the most happening spaces. The happening star is... Actually, there are three happening stars in this game. Koopa Kid, Yoshi, and Waluigi. Oh, we all land on the same amount of happening spaces. Anyway, the game's winner is... It is... Not Koopa Kid. Not Peach. Not Waluigi. But me, the one and only fabulous green dinosaur, Yoshi! I am the Dream Star! Yay! We did it! So from top to bottom. Koopa Kid lost by a mere, I believe that's 15 coins. Anyway, so now we got the detailed results. So I got 342 coins through minigames. Second high was 295, so pretty close there. I had 204 at the most. And let's see all sorts of stats. If Peach had gotten one more happening star, no one would have gotten happening star. Because giving everyone one star does nothing to impact the total. Which makes a lot of sense there. Koopa Kid was the only one to land on a Bowser space and that was at the end of the game. Uh, let's see how many more stats are there. I know there are DK spaces, too. Uh... I land on the most DK spaces, I see. 
And now we see the graph of the stars of everyone. And then. Uh, and then. I accidentally hit the button to exit instead of switching to see the coin graph. Whoops. So that's that for Mario Party 5. I've been Billy12510 and I've enjoyed playing through this game for you all. And I hope to see you all for more crazy adventures in the future. See you all then.